My name is Busisiwe Kanile and it is day two and the final day of the Mayoral Economic Summit 2017. The aim of the summit is to bring together various stakeholders to get them sitting and discuss and solutions and innovative ideas in order to economically move the city forward. Some important topics that were raised at the summit really centered around digital connectivity, some insights in the 2017 budget speech and how that will affect local government. The mayor made it clear that one thing that is very important currently is investment in the city. He made it clear that the city of Tuane is open for business and he wants to see more manufacturing in desolate areas in the city. We look forward to see what will be done about these things and what implementation will happen that will be taken from the summit. We need to move uh, the city to greater heights and the city has potential to move to greater heights. This is something that came up for me, that the city is indeed going to be moving to greater heights if we put certain things in, in, in perspective. Um, one of those being, you know, prioritizing of infrastructure development and infrastructure maintenance, the safety of its residents, um, investment um, in areas that are going to be your, your next um, economic growth areas. Asia, uh, overall my overall impression was that it came at very much the right time. Uh, I've lived in Pretoria myself, although not for some years, but it was a revelation <clears throat> about to hear about what is going on here and how much the city actually has to offer. It is the capital city of the country, and for that reason it, it, it occupies a position of greater importance than, say, Johannesburg, where I'm from and which has also become a, a DA-run city uh, and is experiencing challenges as well, the same as, as uh, this city has. Mm -hmm. Well, number one, the budget of the minister is for the financial year of central government. Mm -hmm. The financial year of the municipal government is different. Yeah. So we can only really start catering and budgeting for the revenue that we're going to receive from national government through the equitable share in our 2017-18 financial year budget. And for that we have to wait for the final proclamation of the Division of Revenue Act. He spoke in broad terms about um, an increase based on a formula between metros and, and uh, smaller municipalities. I cannot at this point tell you whether metros are going to get less mm -hmm. and uh, the rural municipalities are going to get more. Mm -hmm. It's based on a formula um, and that is published in the Division of Revenue Act annually. So unfortunately I can't tell you at this point how, how that's going to pan out. But hopefully um, if we look at the formula and, the, and what it's based on, according to my understanding, it does look at population, it looks at uh, uh, income levels, and we all know what's happened to metropolitan cities over, over the past year, and that is to a higher immigration into metropolitan cities. So hopefully we will be getting a bigger uh, equitable share, mm -hmm. and that equitable share obviously will be used in how we provide services to, to the people of Tswane. And, and, and how do we create an economic environment in which uh, business can invest and we can get growth and jobs and we can accommodate uh, 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 getting more people into the economic uh, environment.